I got out the earlier, tra- I got out the trades that I'd done the day before. Okay, you got out of everything I called yesterday. Right. Okay, that's perfectly fine. Are you are you doing okay here? Like, cause this looks okay. I'm just letting you know. Like, oh, sh- I'm not freaked out. I'm just. Okay. I was okay. just waiting to see if it was going to run into the close. I don't think it is now. No. I, I booked seventy one thousand five hundred dollars today. That's fantastic. That is yeah. so great, Jen. That's fantastic. That's I mean, great. my um, exits. Um, I should have really just taken everything out earlier today when it was high, but. I thought it was going to do one of those old runs. It could um, have. It could have continued today, and obviously the market made new highs. But you got to look at what this did. I mean, you, you can't deny this is just. Again, I know people are probably freaking out about this. That's why I just did the video. But this this was such a big move up today. Such yeah, a big move up. And I'm huge. not saying that it could. I'm not saying it could have done it. But I mean, this was such a big move up today that. You just have to give it a little breathing room, I think. So I think it was the best thing to book everything today, wherever you did it. It was up so much, it almost like you could even, you would have been still up in these here, even now. No, no, wait. When I say I got out of everything, yeah, everything from yesterday, I'm still in every trade you called today. Right, that's okay. But, but yeah, I'm saying the yeah. ones from yesterday, even if you decided, even if you had decided to wait till the very last second today, you still would have been up a lot. Do you know what I'm saying? Well, oh yeah, I did, I did great. I mean, I was up. Nearly two hundred percent. Yeah. So, every time I'm booked, so. like I've, I mean, you're it, again. You're never gonna get out of the high of a long. You're never gonna get out of the low of a short. At some point, you just have to make a decision. Um, but anyways, I just want to make sure you're okay with the rest of them because we're still like pennies, really, when you look at this, like a baby amount away from this previous bar, which is nine sixty eight ninety nine. Right. It's like I mean, really, this is. This just was so big here from today that I think what it's doing is perfectly fine. Like, there's nothing wrong with it. I think it's just gathering its strength for tomorrow morning. Yep, I think it gaps up tomorrow. That's my two Once cents two. on it. Either opens neutral and runs or gaps up tomorrow and runs or gaps up tomorrow and makes a brand new high. That could, I mean, that absolutely, I'm not saying 100% that's going to happen, but I'm saying that could happen. This could open tomorrow at 970. 980. I'm not, I'm not even kidding. I'm not saying 100%, right. but I'm saying I wouldn't no. be surprised if it did. I mean, it could. I mean, $30 is nothing for this stock anymore overnight. Nope. You know? um, um, great calls. Thank you. Um, appreciate it. I know. I mean, I'm, you're, you're doing the best of anyone, quite frankly. I mean, when you, when you look at the dollars and cents, you're doing the best of everyone. One, you're doing all the trades. Two, you're staying on top of it, managing them well. And, um, Okay, so then what, obviously, okay, then, okay, did you get out of everything? Or are you still in Apple? Did you get out of Apple? Did you get out of the market? No, what no, I'm still in Apple. I'm still in Microsoft. Um, I'm still in the SPY. I'm still in the Qs. Um, taking those out probably t- till Friday, I'm, I'm looking like. It's just, I mean, we you know, didn't get to three, uh, 340 in the SPY, which was the number that I really mm-hmm. was thinking was realistic. We, 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 but we rallied today on the Fed things. We rallied. Right. I mean, we've still got two days to go. Again, this is a big move for the market, even though it doesn't, it's, this doesn't look like Tesla. This is like we're rallying every single solitary day. It's, you know, I mean, this is, you know, this is a nice breakout today, but I, 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 I think this looks fine. And again, Apple is going to lift everything if it finally continues over the high. It's it, again. This here's why I'm looking at Apple. If Apple opens neutral, it rallies tomorrow. If Apple opens up, it rallies tomorrow. If Apple opens up a little bit, it rallies. If it opens up a lot, it rallies. The only way this doesn't rally, I can't even think how that was set up. So, no, they've already given us a tiny bit of bad news that shook it up for what two or three days. It's done. I, I think it's back on track. Yeah, was, I, I don't even pay attention to that, but I know you do. But I wouldn't worry about it anyways. Hmm. You know I love Apple. Now, did you do the BYNDs? I thought yesterday was a good exit, but this continued. This I did the BYNDs yesterday and got out. Okay, yeah, um, I think that was fine. But this yeah. went, this continued. That was a nice call, too. This it was... did continue. I know. I saw that. I almost get, got back in the morning, this morning on my own, and then I thought, no, I'll get in trouble. No, no, no. I mean, yeah. I, I think it's good to book money, and this was the one to book money in yesterday. So. Yeah, I think I booked, I think, about 1000 yeah, I don't remember. Fine. So... So yeah, I've, I've had a great week. Um, so great how week. are you? You're are you break even in some of these? Down in some of these? Like now here into the close here, twenty minutes ago. Like where are you at with these? 
Okay, um, on my Tesla position overall, you want to know my number I've got invested and what I, where I'm down? Well, just, just tell me, just tell me, are you, I had, I had, there was 10. Are you in all 10? I'm in all 10, and okay. right now, because of when I went in, was went around when they were called, Yeah. Um, I'm down 20000 Okay, on that's On a $45,000, but you know, I mean, that, that turns like when you snap your fingers. Well, um, yeah. And... Uh, my spy and Q's, um, I'm down nine, it's about nine, ten percent in Microsoft, and um, I'm up. I'm up in one of my spies. I'm down in the other, so I'm just about. I'm like flat in that. And, and what are you up in Apple? Amazon. Um, I didn't get out of that today. I'm going to let it run till Friday. Maybe. Okay. What are you? What are you up in Apple? And what are you up in Amazon? I'm up uh, 442 in Apple. I'm only up. Um, 14 right now in Amazon. Well, Amazon, again, was up at 2185. This was up a lot more. This, again, whips around like a crazy bastard, too. So, yeah, they, yeah I mean, um, but if the market continues, the, I'm looking for this to get over. Do you see the chart here? Over, over this point, which it uh -huh. retested today. Again, this could happen on the day tomorrow. This could happen in a gap up. 2185 2185 right. so if you wanted to get out today you would you should have gotten out there if you didn't right. and you want to hold it i'm looking for a jump and so a gap up so but basically but if you wanted to get out you, you that's where you would have gotten out today when it didn't get oh. over that number but anyways it's fine it's fine if, again if everything runs and everything's going to run as far as the market ones i called that same strike because the other ones are lagging and i'm like i don't know anymore now about the ones from before like Whenever that right. was last week. So I'm like, you know, but they could come back to break even at least or small gain. If this well, they'll, to they'll come back to something, I'm sure. If yeah. not, it's, it's OK. But I mean. the new ones I call will more than make up for the for the old ones. Absolutely. So um, great calls on those as well. Um, I'm trying to think if there was anything else. No, I oh, guess that's I see seven. Tesla's back up 57 right now. Apple's up four. So here's what I said on this other video. I'll just give you the recap. This okay. is going to close today with a baby, a baby bar, almost at the open point, or a baby red or a baby green. Like, that's exactly what it's doing right now. I just did the video 10 minutes ago. It's going right back there. Look at I it. Did. Uh, probably right around 925. I think it opened around 923 or something, yeah, 924. Look at it. This is great. And again, you have people that shorted this, which is nutty. So this is why this is going to go back up because people will buy it on the dip. But people actually, day traders shorted this today, if you didn't believe it. It's not going to go anywhere down. You know, um, I I don't know. I think, I think it is going to go a little higher before the close. Yeah. But anyways, either way, whether this closes right now this second, whether it closes over 925 or whatever, like I think it's perfectly okay. Even the ones that I called really tight because this has to make the move tomorrow. It, it just does. Like it has to right. make them it has to make another move tomorrow and in my opinion here after the way that it traded today. So, after the way that it traded today, this has to make a big move tomorrow on the day or in the gap. So that's the way I'm looking at it for the rest of the ones. I've intentionally just, I know you don't, I watched the market today reaction and I watched it, it but was I wasn't a good, really, um, go ahead. you know, it was good. I mean, the streets, the streets, I think we're going to rally tomorrow. I do. I don't, I wasn't, it wasn't, a, I didn't think it was going to be anything bad. If I was concerned, I would have watched it. Now, what was that thing you said about sleeping with one eye open or what, what were you saying? Oh, there? I was joking. When I do these trades, it's like, I always sleep with one eye open. I can't help it because I wake up in the night and I have to look at my screen really quick and see where things are. Because and, there's so many on, is that what you mean? Yeah, because I have so much out there right now. But, uh, but, but you made $71,000 today. So there's like, there's, there's nothing like there's, I mean, there's, it, oh, I'm excited. Like... <laughs> That's why it's like I'm like a little kid about it. I'm excited. It's oh, not yeah. like I'm stressed out. It's like I'm like, oh, I, I'm going to miss something. But it you know? is exhausting to watch these all day because this could have run up today. I mean, you had to watch this today just to see. Like, But at a certain point, then you, you, I knew it wasn't going to, but it could have. It could have. This morning, you didn't know, you know if it right. was going to run up today. And it, it is it, exhausting to watch it, too. It, it's it's funny. exhausting because you're just sitting here watching it to make sure you get a good exit. But anyways... Um, I certainly, when I called this trade yesterday, I knew it would gap up 100%.
but I did not know that it would gap up as much as it did. I was even surprised when we talked. That about was it. an amazing gap today. It was great. Yeah. So let's just so. see. It closed at eight sixty. Yeah. It it gapped up sixty three and a half points. So the fact that it's doing this here now is absolutely fine. Perfect. Well, right, I look well, forward to a great day tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks oh, for everything. I appreciate you're it. You're going to buy another, another property. Yeah, I think I will. Probably. Another Airbnb. <laughs> yeah, I can move, I'll move out of my Airbnb and start, start being an adult again. Okay, I think All that's right. a good idea. Thank you. <laughs> All right, talk to you later. Okay, okay bye. Bye. bye.